So you might be in this really weird situation where for some reason your iPhone is just displaying black dots on the display and you're trying to figure out what's going on. Now this can mean a couple of different things. The very first thing I recommend doing here for the most part is just making sure that your iPhone doesn't actually have a hardware problem. Meaning that if your iPhone display actually does have hardware issues, meaning the black dots are part of your iPhone display being bad, well you may want to just go through and make sure that that's not the issue. So you may want to go and try restarting your phone or even sending your iPhone into Apple if it's a hardware issue. That's kind of the only way to fix it. Now if you do that and that's not, you know, if you do that and that's still, you know, not causing the issue or let's say that's not the issue, the first thing I recommend doing is restarting your iPhone. So go through and restart your device so you can hold down your device right here, slide the power off, power back on, and you want to see if that ends up fixing the problem which for a ton of people, you would actually be surprised, that could very well end up fixing the problem for a lot of people out there. Now, if you do that and that's still not working, like let's say that's still not fixing the issue, the next thing I recommend doing here is to actually go through and basically see if there's an update available for your iPhone. So you can make your way over into your iPhone settings, which is right here. And then what I'd recommend doing is scrolling down into your general settings, which is right here, tapping on software update, and basically going through and software updating your iPhone. This by far in and of itself is another easy way to go and fix this problem as well. And that's kind of what I'd recommend going through and basically, you know, kind of going through and fixing this problem here too. Now, if that's still not working, the other thing you may want to try doing here is to actually go through and see if there's an application that's causing these issues. If there's something like that, that might end up causing issues. You may also want to make sure it's not the wallpaper causing problems either. But those are kind of the main ways to go and fix the problem for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.